to Stephens Crypto, just a very quick uh, update on Quant again. Before we start, as always, like this video and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want to join uh, my trade signal group where I give daily trade alerts, then check out the first link in the description below this video. We are very profitable, so check it out. Also, let me show you just a few trades. Uh, these on the right side are trades that uh, I told all of my signal group members to enter a long position at um, before the pump actually happened. And anyone who did is already in a very decent profit. So if you want daily uh, trade alerts just like this, then check out the link in the description below this video. Okay, we are here on the quant daily chart and we can see a very nice daily engulfing green candle and let's see tomorrow if we are going to get some follow through because this is a good start for this uh, wave b very nice candle today uh, quant is up a bit compared to a lot of other cryptos and um yeah and, uh, and i told you in the previous update on quant that uh, the 102 dollar level was the first resistance to watch and that is exactly where quant got rejected today so pretty well uh, yeah yeah predicted actually on this channel and uh, yeah quant got uh, very nicely rejected at that level so still a lot of room here on the daily time frame to grow we are almost getting uh, the bullish uh, yeah the buy signal here on this indicator uh, every time we are in this oversold region we are now in the oversold region and we get a green dot uh, quant got a significant pull towards the upside you can see it right here on the 16th of june 2022 that was at the low and quant got a significant pull towards the upside um, let me give you another example maybe this one here when we were at the 24th of january we got a green dot and quant got a significant pull towards the upside and right now it is happening again i think tomorrow we have the green dot and that will basically mean a significant push up for quant towards the upside so prepare yourself for that let's zoom in a little bit to the four hourly time frame and let's by the way um, let me first explain to the new subscribers because the channel is growing quite fast. So I have to explain sometimes things uh, a little bit extra. So yeah, pay, I, I ask you guys for patience uh, on that. Um, yeah, Quant made a low here on the 13th of June 2022. In my opinion, the bottom is absolutely in for Quant. We came up in a five wave structure in the Elliott wave impulse towards the upside. And right now we are in a wave two in the form of an ABC correction. And after that, you get your wave three, four and five. So you get the picture. We are right now in the ABC correction. And in my opinion, if I zoom in here, the wave A is finished and we are right now in the wave B. So we got we finished the wave A and right now we are pushing up in the wave B. And today Quant got exactly rejected at that level. I gave you guys earlier today at 102 dollars so yeah that's the first area for quant to break through of course and uh, let me give you other resistance and support areas for quant so if we break through this level here then the first next resistance is 105 dollars and 20 cents and then the 109 dollars will be major resistance here and our target uh, where I think quant can go most likely to is $114.20 all the way to, um, yeah, depends on how you draw it, but all the way to $115.80. Uh, so yeah, that's the most likely target for Quant for the wave B. Of course, we can go much higher than that. We can go to 120 or even higher. That's definitely possible. But I will. I definitely want to take it step by step and keep you guys updated every day on this channel. So if scenario changes, if the scenario is different, I will, of course, update every one of you. So yeah, the uh, big support to hold is, of course, the $92. But uh, yeah, I assume that we are going to hold this. Uh, for now, let's check the four hour indicators. Um, yeah, nothing to say. It's just a lot of room to push towards the upside. The one hour was a little bit, yeah, I cannot call a 68 on the RSI overbought, but yeah, we got some kind of a rejection here. So let's see the upcoming hours, how this will develop itself. So thanks a lot uh, for watching, guys. By the way, if you're interested in this also, the... Um, I told everyone in the previous update also that the DXY, the dollar index, is losing significant amount of strength and it's stopping out at the moment for all of you guys who are interested in that because, yeah, we were watching at quant against the US dollar, so maybe it's interesting to watch the US dollar by itself. Uh, we were in a significant parabolic run towards the upside from the 1st of January 2021 and since then the dollar index was 
yeah it's in a parabolic run towards the upside you can clearly see um yeah higher highs here on the chart and on the rsi indicator this is the three daily time frame you can clearly see significant lower highs which basically means a significant bearish divergence that always tends to happen at the end of a trend and that uh, signals a trend reversal so we are rolling over here and we can expect the next few days the next few weeks the dollar index to yeah break the uptrend and uh, start the next downtrend and that will basically mean a significant bull run for the whole crypto asset class and also for yeah for all the cryptos we are going to see significant uh yeah price increases especially for bitcoin so yeah pretty interesting to uh, watch that on the radar thanks a lot for watching make sure to like this video subscribe to my channel and also let me know in the comment section below if you want me to uh, cover the DXY index uh, always together with Quant. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.